uncleanness, lasciviousness, idolatry, witchcraft, hatred, verities, emulations, wrath, strife, sedations, heresies, envy, murders, drunkards, ravers, and such like. In other words, anything that falls in this category. Of which I tell you before, and I've told you in time past, past and present, that they which do such things shall not inherit the kingdom of what? God. Those which do such things shall not inherit the kingdom of God. That's not my words. That's not my list I read to you. I read it to you out of your Bible. These are the works of the flesh that were described in 1 Corinthians, also described to young Timothy. Also, he said, they neither nor shall not go to the kingdom of heaven. I don't care what Joel Osteen does say. I don't care, hello somebody, say amen. I, amen. It can take me a year to preach all this in its entirety. I'm, I, I, I continue to highlight it, but we've already covered the fornication and adultery and, and all the wickedness and the envy and strife and murders. We talked about church people murdering their own brother and sister with their tongue. Witchcraft, witchcraft, which is translated here in the Greek, is not witches riding on words. Latin is pharmacia. The Greek is pharmakia. Pharmakia in the, in the, it simply means drug is for to get high. Which brings us into a drug addicted age. We are spellbound as scores of people under the addiction of drugs, pharmaceutical drugs, just the same as we are street drugs. We have a church age and a people that are addicted to pharmaceutical drugs, they just think they're going to die if they don't get such and such pills. They think they're going to have a pill to mellow them out, going to have a pill to get them up in the morning, going to have a pill to get them through the day. Somebody stay with me. Don't bring them along. Tell old somebody. It is, a, it is a spirit of witchcraft that is coming to the land where if we had God with all of our heart, mind, body, and soul, God would fix you, friend. He would heal you and raise you up. Amen. We have become spellbound under these drugs. Drugs that are running our country. It's running the political side. Drugs are controlling monstrosity of, 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 of school teachers, police officers, uh, politicians uh, that are engaged in drugs that you don't know nothing about. They don't take them, but they are partakers and distributing them. By being drug, involved in drugs myself and alcohol, a man that is a, is, a, uh, is a distributor, he don't use the drugs himself. He's not a user. He's a seller for the money. Hello. He's the man that is under the spell of the witchcraft. He controls you. Amen. I'm here to tell you, friend, there is people sitting in Grace Chapel. There is people sitting by the way of radio. There are people that are sitting all over this land. You are controlled by drugs. Come on. Come on. You that are sitting in the church houses are condemning those outside down on the streets and the alleys. You're condemning those that you see that are locked up in jail for methamphetamine and methamphetamine and crack cocaine and marijuana and you are still hooked on the pharmaceutical drug yourself. Yeah. 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 But you're 
Right. Tell me it's not witchcraft. Just read the Bible. Talks about 